Okay, uh, we're using our uh, Screencastify app. Um, Camarama is a uh, a little uh, Linux webcam app. So we're kind of using that. So what we did is we casted from Chrome. So we're using uh, Snagit for Chrome. Um, the computer system we're in is um, Linux Mint 17, an LTS version, Cinnamon. So again, you, the menu kind of looks Windows 70, except it actually uh, works good. So for example, when I search, it's pretty responsive, pretty quick. Kind of wish the uh, Windows 7 menu actually worked as well when I was using Windows 7. So again, we can pull this over. I'm over here. I'm over here. So I kind of have this uh, camera full screen on the desktop. Um, I have a partition of InSync, which is a, a backup for Google Drive. But uh, how I I ended up going to Google Drive all the time, even though I was syncing it to my computer, and then you know opening it in um, LibreOffice. Um, and I was like, well, if I'm going to Google Drive all the time. Uh, they uh, added an option where I could um, not have it converted. And I was, oh, that makes sense. So that's kind of like what I do is it just saves them in the Google Drive format. And what's really nice about this is since I don't have any, I don't have any desktop, I don't have, have LibreOffice or OpenOffice on the computer. So if I click, the InSync helper automatically opens it in Google Drive. And we'll see what that looks like. That's kind of nice. I like that. So, um, you know, where I think I am at now, I've had a couple of different options. I've had Screencastify on Chrome, another kind of a competitor to um, TechSmith. And TechSmith has added some neat things lately. And um, I've used Kazam on my uh, Linux desktop. But I think where I'm heading is... Um, because of my Chromebook and my Linux Mint, it would be nice to use one um, piece of software that will work both on my Chromebook and on my Linux box. And I think where I'm heading is uh, TechSmith. Um, I think that's what will offer me that um, has a whole bunch of nice features, especially with the new GIF coming up. So I think where I'm heading is um, I've, you know, uninstalling the Screencastify on my Chrome browser and sticking with um, TechSmith and I'll probably get rid of